Hello guys, if you can hear me and um, can you hear me guys? Please, if you can hear me, let me know if you can hear me. I have some issues here, technical issues. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? If you can hear me, type on the comment section, I can hear you. All right, um, let's begin. Let's begin with the class. Uh, my network is fluctuating here. Let's begin with the class here. So, guys, um, you're welcome once again. You're welcome. My name is Stanley TGOK. You're welcome to this live changing webinar. You're welcome. So, if you're just joining us now, and if you can hear me loud and clear, go to the comment section and type, I can hear you. Please don't mind my camera. It's. Um, Technical issues, please. Go to the comment section and type, I can hear you. If you can hear me, go to the comment section and type, I can hear you. Please, I want to be sure that we can hear me clearly before we proceed with this section. I have to be sure that you can hear me. All right, Chisholm said, I can hear you. So now let's proceed. Um, I welcome you all to this uh, e-commerce dropshipping uh, webinar. You're welcome, guys. So in this webinar, this, this webinar is going to last for the next one hour it's going to last for the next one hour guys so um let's proceed since my camera is misbehaving let me just switch it so slide only so you can see only the slide all right so i welcome you once again to this drive this drop e-commerce drop shipping webinar my name is stanley ggok so um the outline for this today's live webinar, the outline for today's live webinar is this. I don't know if you can see my screen clearly. If you can see my screen clearly, comment on the, drop your comment on the comment section that you can hear me and you can see my screen. If you can see my screen, comment below. If you can see my screen, comment below if you can see my screen. If you can see my screen, comment below, please. Okay, so let's let's proceed. I assume you can see my screen. So let's let's proceed. So now the outline for this section here today, I'll be sharing with you everyone here. Okay, you can see it. Okay, I'll be sharing with everyone here the seven basic steps to getting started with e-commerce dropshipping business. Okay, and also I'll be sharing the secret on how I was able to launch my e-commerce store and hit six figures within. Four weeks. I hit um, six figures within four weeks. That is a month. Okay. So now, right here, I. So now, I would like you all to get rid of any form of distractions. Anything that you know is going to distract you from this live um, webinar. If you know anything that's going to distract you, or television and everything, just take them off. Okay. So you can focus on what I will be sharing here with you today. I also advise you to get your pen and um your paper okay so you can draw down one or two points here as i proceed with this these sections all right now stay with me to the end if you stay with me to the end of this live webinar you are going to be discovering the exact steps on how you can start your e-commerce dropshipping business within the next 48 hours and how i was able to generate six figures within four weeks by just selling a single Product, by selling only one product, I was able to make six figure in a month. So at the end of this training, you will learn how to create and launch a profitable e-commerce business for yourself. So now, before I continue, before I continue, you must know that my results, the results I've gotten so far from this business are not typical. You cannot achieve that, you cannot achieve what I have achieved or what some of my students have achieved. If all you do is just to get this information and keep them aside. So you're going to get results or you're going to see the same 
results that I've gotten or some of my students have gotten only if you take action, only if you implement what I'm going to share with you right here today. So now, I work hard and you must work, you must put in that work too if you want to see the same results. So guys, if you can see my screen clearly, I would like to share with you some of my, some of the testimony from some of my students. Okay, here it is. Some of the testimony from my students. This is from um, Sulia. She says, the best tutor I've ever met, I've ever met, I never regret to be one of your luckiest students. Mr. Sandy goes to teach you from A to Z with little money. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, this is one of the review from one of my past students. Another review from one of my past students from Ayobami. You are a great teacher. You can read them too. Another one from um, Lua Shewu. You can read them too. So that there are a lot of review I would love to share here with you. Okay, but we did not start this webinar on time, so I don't want to show you this review because this review is not going to give you the results you're looking for. So let's proceed with um, the training, okay? So now, reasons why this business model will work for you. Here are the reasons why this particular business for you. So Chisholm say it's not clear. So Chisholm, just please, just listen to what I'm saying, okay? I believe you can hear me, okay? I'm just reading out what I'm having on this slide. I'm reading out what I have on my slide. Okay, so why reasons why this business model will work for you. This will work for you because you don't need a physical store to start an e-commerce business. You don't need to have a shop in a um, um, computer village in Lagos or a Dumata market in Lagos before you can start e-commerce business. You don't need a physical store. All you need is an online store, not a physical store. In the e-commerce of shipping business, Chia Goze says it's seriously cracking. What is cracking, Chia Goze? Is it the screen? Is it the screen that is cracking? Let me know what is cracking, please. Chia Goze says it's seriously cracking. What is cracking, Chia Goze? Let me know what is cracking. Let me know what is cracking, please. So now, just listen to what I'm saying. I'm sharing here with you. Just listen to what I'm sharing here with you. You don't need a physical store to start an e-commerce business. Okay, my voice is cracking. What about now, please? What about now? Is it still cracking? Is my voice still cracking, please? Oh. My voice, is this still cracking? Let me know before I proceed. Is the voice still cracking? Is my voice still cracking, guys? Is this still cracking? Okay, he said no, the voice is not cracking. So let's continue. So on the e-commerce or shipping business, you can make unbelievable, you can make unbelievable profit from the e-commerce or shipping business. You can make unbelievable profit, okay? So now this business model is simple and it's not complicated, okay? Unlike many other business out there like the affiliate marketing, the networking marketing, ADC, and the rest of them, where you have to post extensively to promote through platforms like WhatsApp to make substantial earnings. Okay, this is not that kind of business model. Okay, you don't have to come to your WhatsApp to start posting hundreds of images, hundreds of video for people to buy from you. You don't have to start begging your customers to buy from you. Just imagine you having um, 1,000 contacts on your list, and those contacts on your list are maybe your friend from school. And you're not sharing products to them. Let's say, for this, let's say, for example, you're sharing um, um real estate products to them for them to buy property. So most of the contacts on your list will not be able to afford the property. Hope you're getting it. Okay, this is not that kind of business where you have to come and post all over WhatsApp. Okay, let's proceed. So now uh, you don't need to be where your customer are before you can sell to them. You don't have to go to your customer physically. You don't have to meet your customer physically for you to be able to make sales to your customer, guys. You don't have to be present physically before you can make sales to them. Okay? So now, um, this training is not for everyone, okay? This training is specifically for people, okay? They are specific. This training is specifically designed for some group of persons, not for everyone, okay? So now, this training is for you if You've heard about e-commerce of shipping and um, you want to know how it works. This training 
is for you. If you want a system that will generate cash whenever you have need for money, this training is also for you. So if you also you want to learn or you're willing to learn high in demand skills and um, instantly get started with making good money off your skills, this training is also for you guys. And um, if you're worried on how, if you're worried about how you are going to start a successful e-commerce dropshipping business because you are not a tech person, this training is for you because you are going to discover how some of my students did it without any initial knowledge about using the internet. So now this training is not for anyone who is lazy. Okay, anyone who has this lazy mindset who is not ready to work, this training is not for you. It's not also this training is not also available, or it's not for people who have this um this get rich quick mindset. Okay, if you have the get rich seat and rich mindset, not just like those who love MMM or you bring one person to get or bring one person to get two persons or something like that, this training is not for you. Or you want to make money without acquiring the knowledge first. If you want to make money without acquiring the right knowledge, this training is not for you. So guys, in case you're wondering who is this person that has been talking this way, who are you, who is this person, why must I listen to this person? So please just wait a minute, let me introduce myself. I was supposed to do this from the beginning, but just wait. Give me some seconds, let me introduce myself. Okay, my name is Stanley TJK. I'm a seven-figure digital marketing consultant. I share my digital marketing experience and my journey on this page so that anyone who is just getting started can learn and implement to improve their business online and offline. So I share my experience basically for those people who are just getting started with online business so that they can learn from some of the mistakes we've made and so they can also improve their business online and offline. Okay, so we start first with um, e-commerce dropshipping. What is the meaning of e-commerce dropshipping? What is e-commerce dropshipping? So now, um, e-commerce dropshipping or e-commerce basically means the buying and selling of items online. It could be the buying and selling of physical products online. So um, dropshipping, on the other hand, means selling means selling a product online that did okay now drop shipping means selling a product online that you don't have in stock okay it's selling a product that you don't have in stock or you don't have in a particular shop somewhere so that is drop shipping so you simply do all you simply do in drop shipping you do retail fulfillment whereby a customer purchase a particular product from you or an item from you then you pay the supplier then the supplier or the seller in this case supplies this product directly to the customer or you you can either do retail fulfillment or you do reselling okay so whichever way is better for you just do it okay the main thing here is that you don't have to get or you don't have to come in contact with this product you don't have to have physical contact with this product or physical contact with um the customer who need this particular product so now here is a diagram that I explain um drop shipping okay so here we have the customer we have your store which is your online store we have a supplier okay so now this store is not a physical store it's an online store the customer reach out to you then you probably because you promoted a particular product the customer will reach out to you then you reach out to the supplier of the product then the supplier will sends this product to the customer to your customer so you make profit out from this transaction so each transactions you make you are going to make profit out from it okay all you simply do here basically is to link the customer to the supplier okay so please let me know if you can still hear me please let me know if you can still hear me loud and clear and you can still see my slide let me know if you can still see it okay so um so I'll be sharing with you here the seven steps to start a profitable e-commerce dropshipping business. Seven steps you need to, to, to do or the seven things you need to do to set up or start up your e-commerce dropshipping business in Nigeria. So now follow these exact steps 
and you will have success and profitable dropshipping business than you can ever imagine. Just follow my, my steps I will be sharing here with you. Just share, follow the step I'll be sharing here with you, okay? So now the first thing we do here, which is the first step, we choose a niche. You choose a niche. Okay, now, so a niche is a distinct or targeted market inside a bigger market. So a niche is a distinct or a smaller part of a bigger market. For example, in a broad or clothing market, women clothing is a niche. So now let me use this example. Let me just explain this more for you here. So a niche, for example, let's say um, the computer village in Lagos, the computer village in Lagos, or where they say, okay, computer village, yeah. Where they sell gadgets, the phone, and the rest of them. So that is a, that computer village is a market, okay? So inside that market, there are particular shops where they sell some specific products like the um, um, Samsung phone, the iPhone, and other um, categories of phone products, okay? Other brands of phone. So now, when you come to that market, that particular market or shop where they sell Samsung phone is known as a niche. It's just a part in a bigger market. That is a niche, okay? So now, um, here are the key benefits um, of using, uh, here are the key, here are some key benefits to this strategy. Here are some benefits or advantage for using a, or selecting or picking a niche. Here are the important things you need to do, okay? If you pick a niche, okay? There are some benefits for you if you start your e-commerce business firstly by picking a niche here are some of the benefits okay so now when you are marketing to a niche audience it will be way easier to find and reach your best customers when you are marketing to a niche it is to a niche audience it is it will be way easier to find and reach your best customers because you share super specific trends and habits secondly generally the, the narrower your niche, the less competition you will have. The narrower your niche, the less competition you will have. So if you pick a niche, for example, let's say you're into the gadget niche, it will be very easy for you to target people that buy gadget products because you can just easily target gadgets. Gadgets are interest on Facebook when you're doing your marketing campaign. Gadget is an interest. So you can just target your ideal audience. You don't have to target a random base audience here. You will target your ideal audience. Your ideal audience are people who have the potential of buying the product from you. These are people that can bring out their wallet online and pay for your product. Those are your ideal audience. So your niche is going to make it possible for you to target your ideal audience. So now the third one here is that you will have a better chance of getting loyal customers. Who will trust you to meet you? Who will trust who trust you to meet their unique needs and wishes? So if you have um, a niche you're targeting on, you are going to be getting customers who will be loyal to your brand. Okay. So now here are some some of the examples of some of the niches. Okay. Here are some of the example of some of the niches you should keep in mind. These niches are trending niche. These niches are hot niche. You can venture into today and you start seeing massive, massive results. So now, example of one of the niche here is a beauty niche. So now, under the beauty niche, we have some products like the all-natural makeup kits, the eyeshadow platelets, the fake eyelashes, and the men's skincare products. They are under the beauty niche. So the next one here is the gadget niche. Under the gadget niche, we have things like the mini wireless Bluetooth speaker, you have the cervical neck doctor. You also have the electric slimming machine. And then um, also we have here the smart smartwatch is under the gadget niche. So the next niche here you should pay attention or you put more, in, um, more interest in here is the wellness and health niche. Under the wellness and health niche, we have products like the flame aroma diffuser. We have the body detoxing pad. We have the mosquito killer traps, um, we have the smart posture corrector, we also have the anti-hair loss shampoo. So these are some of the products under the health and wellness niche. So now, under the niche, we basically have two kinds of niche. We have the steady niche, 
and then we have this trending niche. A steady niche, uh, also called as a green, evergreen niche, is one that will have demand. It's one that we have demand. Your, sorry, I'm coming. It's one that we have demand your year round for a long time to come. So this is a product that is going to be selling year in, year out, week in, week out. So it sells every time of the day, every time of the month or every time of the week, okay? These are steady niche, okay? So you can also check, you can also check if a particular niche is steady or trending niche. So how do we do this? For you to be able to check which niche is trending or which niche is steady, you can do that through the use of your Google Trends or your Google, okay, Google Trend, yeah. So you go back to Google Trend on your Google browser, you type that particular niche. For example, in this case, I use, um, the men's sunglasses here if you look at this graph here if you can see it clearly if you look at this graph here you notice the graph has a kind of a trending the trending graph it's trend upwards if you look at it closely it trends upward if you can see it type on the comment section you can see my screen as you can see the graph it trends upward so this are example or this is a this is a graph of its steady niche this is a graph of a steady niche so it's very important you should find a niche or you should be selling a product that is under the steady niche okay let me show you next the next slide i'll be showing you the graph of um, a trending niche so now this is it this example of a trending niche this is a graph i will using the, i use the product called the fidget spinner to to search on the google trend okay you can also do that from the end to see what i'm saying here or you see what I'm showing you here, okay? You go to the search and you search for fidget spinner. If you look at this graph, the graph went up, it trended only once and it moves down. So this is an example of a trending niche. So now I would advise anyone to start selling such products. So now trending niche are niches that maybe would go or we sell at some particular time of the year due to a particular trend. So let's say, for example, uh, for those in the Western countries, during the Halloween period, you tend to see sales in Halloween products up. It's going to increase. The sales in Halloween products is going to increase. So now, for those of us in this part of the world, for, Nigeria, for example, Nigeria in this case, we don't sell or we don't use anything like Halloween products here. So anyone venturing into this kind of product or selling products under this kind of niche might be running out of loss. Just imagine, for example, and the video promoted a particular product. And um, within some particular week, that product is trending. And you now went and stock those products and start, let's say you bought like hundreds of those products. So after some week and month, the demand for that product will drop. So you end up not selling those products because those products are under the trending niche. So it's always advisable you should look for products in the steady niche, okay? Hope you're hearing me. So now, um, one of the best way to get Okay, one of the best ways to get niche and um, product idea is to simply look around you at your own, you should, look at, you should also look at your own buying habits and what others are buying. So I will advise you all here to focus on steady niche. When you're picking out a niche, you focus on the steady niche. You can go in the gadget niche, you can pick a product in the health and wellness niche. Here are two niche I pick most of my products on. The product I sell online, the product that my ads are currently, currently running, two of my ads are currently running on Facebook. I picked one of the products on the gadget niche and also on the health and wellness niche. For me, these two niches are selling. They are selling big time, okay? So the next step here, the next thing we need to do here, after we must have discovered our niche, the next thing we need to do here is products research so now basically product research basically refer to the act of finding a product that meets all specification of a likely to be hot selling product so the product we should be selling are products that are hot in demand okay solution based products don't just come and pick any kind of product and sell online you pick solution based products let me just tell you this now for those of you who are into e-commerce or you want to start e-commerce, okay? So please, 
don't sell any product that has to do with sizes or sell any product that has to do with color because most times your customers might not okay let's say for example your customer pick size 40 and when the product gets to the customer it's not going to be their size don't sell such kind of product but that has to do with sizes and what has to do with color let's proceed so now here are some of the criteria of a hot selling product so now factors to you should look out for before settling for a particular product the first factor here is that the product should have a clear use case don't just sell any kind of product here the product should solve a particular problem the product should solve a particular problem those are the kind of products that sell very well and fast online number two the product should not be readily available in the local stores around you the, the product should not be available in a uh, mama and kitty shop down the street or it should not be available in the next supermarket around you okay those are the kind of products you should be looking out for and also don't go for products that have a fixed prices so if you pick a product that are available in stores around you, people or customers or people that will be in need of that product already know the price of that product. So it's not advisable for you to go for such products. So for me, this is what I always do. I will source for products that are less than 5,000. Let's say 5,000, I'll pick products that are around the range of 1,000 to 5,000. So it will be possible for me to um, scale the product and sell it two times or three times the cost of that product so now pick products that are not available in the market and also pick products that don't have a fixed price pick products that don't have a fixed price very important and lastly here yeah, it should have a mind catching advantage this product should have a mind catching advantage please i hope you're jotting you're jotting down all this because this video might not be available here for a long time this video might not be available here for a long time so now i'll be sharing with you like four of the hot selling products i i have on my um my 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 list here i am running i'm currently running ads on some of these products here i'll be sharing that with you i'll also be sharing the interest the interest i use in targeting my customers my ideal customers online so now number one product here this is one of the products here. I don't know if you can still see my screen. If you can still see my screen, drop a comment below that you can see my screen. If you can still see my screen, drop a comment that you can see my screen. So now the number one product here, which is um under the health and wellness niche. This product is under the health and wellness niche. The product name is Neck Rechargeable Massager. Please guys, write this product down. Write this product down. The health, the neck rechargeable massager. The neck rechargeable massager. Okay, so now this particular product I just mentioned here is under the health and wellness niche. This product is under the health and wellness niche. So if you go over to um, AliExpress, this product has been sold for Let's say 10,000 of these others has been made, or 10,000 pieces of 10,000 pieces of this product has been sold on AliExpress. 10,000 of this product has been sold on AliExpress. He doesn't say that he can hear me, okay? So now here are some of the interests you should be targeting when selling this particular product. Please write this down. Write this down. Very, very important. Take your pen and paper and write this down. Here are some of the interests you should be targeting when selling this product if you are into e-commerce already you should take down this interest it's very important so the first interest here list of interests to target when running facebook ad campaign number one interest here is fitness the second second interest here is yoga the third one here is bodybuilding so just go to your detail targeting in your um, ad section your ad set section then you pick some of these interests i'm listing down here for you today you pick personal development, personal development after bodybuilding, personal development. The next one is health supplement, health supplement. The next on my list here is meditation, followed by massage therapy, 
massage therapy. We also have self-care. We have spa and wellness. And last interest here is wellness. So guys, write this down. These are the interests you should be targeting when selling products. When selling this particular product, this product, the neck rechargeable massager. So whenever you're selling any kind of product that has to do with massaging, you should be targeting this interest. Very, very important. I'm not going to repeat that again. The next product on my list is um, a creative frameless DIY wall clock. I'm currently running advert. Product is on niche. I am currently running ad on this product. So you should know what you're doing. Since I said I'm running ad on this product, you should take note of this particular product I'm listing out here. These are kinds of hot police, or these are a kind of hot and selling products you should be looking out for. Solution-based products you should be looking out for. So now if you go over to AliExpress, hundred thousands of this product has been sold on AliExpress. Hundred pieces of hundred thousand pieces of this particular product have been sold on aliexpress i have sold more than 50 pieces of this product i have sold more than 50 pieces of this hot uh, this product on facebook so now here are the interests i've been targeting on facebook here are the list of interests i've been targeting here on facebook so now list of interest to target when running facebook ad campaign number one here the number one interest i'm targeting is home decoration home decor it's followed by interior decoration the next on my list here is time management. Time management. I hope you put, you're taking down this interest I'm listing here for you. Time management. I also target clocks, luxury goods, engaged shoppers, luxury living, world arts, and then vintage clocks. Those are the interests you should be targeting on. I have moved, I've sell up to 50 pieces of this particular product. So this is a hot selling product currently. It's a hot selling product. The next on my list here, is it the last? Okay, now this is the third on my list here. It's called the air powered, the air powered plunger. The air powered plunger. So now this is a home improvement device. This is a home improvement device. I have time running ads on this particular product. I'm waiting for Facebook to approve these ads to start running. You can't find this product I'm showing you here in any shop or stores around. You can hardly find this product I'm sharing with you here in any stores or shop around your present location. This particular product is under the home improvement um, niche. It's a home improvement device. So as I'm talking to you currently, 2,000 pieces of this product have been sold on AliExpress. This product is still a new product. This product is still a new product. So this product, you use it mostly whenever you have blockage in your, in your toilet, in your, um, in your sink, or in any part of your home, in your kitchen, then you have blockage in your drainage system and the rest of you. This particular product can help you to, to clear it, to clear that blockage. Look at the diagram clearly. You can go and search this product on AliExpress or any of the e-commerce sites. You can go there and search it. So now, See, here are some of the interests you can target when running this product. Here are some of the interests you can target when running these products or when running campaign on Facebook. You can target plumbing, you can target home improvement, you can target home repairs, you can also target plumbing services, home renovations, and home maintenance. Okay, the next I have on my list here, I have to run this very fast because we have. We don't have much time again. We have to run this through this live webinar for the next one hour. We have to run this live webinar for the next one hour. So the next I have here, which is going to be the last product here, is called the multifunctional vegetable chopper. So this product is a general product used mostly used by everyone in the kitchen. I believe if you're watching this video here, you must have eaten something this night. So you always go to the kitchen. So this product can be used by men, women. It's a general base product, okay? It's a general base product. So for this kind of product, this product firstly is under the kitchen niche. This product is under the kitchen niche. 12,000 pieces of this product have been sold on AliExpress. 12,000 pieces 
of these products have been sold on AliExpress. So now here are the list you should be targeting, list of interest you should be targeting when running Facebook ad for this particular product. You should be targeting interests like cooking, kitchen gadgets, kitchen tools, healthy eating, kitchen appliances, kitchen chopper, kitchen organization, healthy, life, healthy lifestyle, and um, home chef. I have sold so far 23 or 25, but I've, not, I've sold up to 25 pieces of particular product. And um, I'm still hoping to sell more because my ad is currently running for these products. So you can pick more than one hot selling product and start selling at a time. You can pick more than one hot selling product and start selling at a time. So kitchen niche is also a niche you should be looking out for because a lot of persons are interested in a way or interested in products that are going to make uh, most of the activities in the kitchen less stressful, okay? Hope you can still hear me. Hope you can still hear me. Okay, um, Gideon say he can hear me. So all right, let's proceed. The next step, which is the third step here, is to search for is to search for um supplier. So remember, you've gotten a niche. You've gotten a niche. You have sourced for your own hot selling product. The next thing you need to do here. The next thing you need to do here is to search for supplier. So um, Emmanuel is asking for, Emmanuel say, why don't sir, please explain the term interest. So now Emmanuel, interest is, um, interest, we mostly use interest when we're talking about targets. If you are used to Facebook adverts, if you're used to Facebook adverts, whenever you're running an ad campaign and you want to share your product to your ideal customers, if you want to share your product to your ideal customers, you should have a particular interest of people, or you should have a particular keyword of people that will be people or keywords that are related to that product. You should have keywords that are related to a particular product. For example, now, for example, this uh, multi-purpose chopper. Keywords that are keywords of people that might be interested in that product are keywords like cooking, like chef. Um, kitchen appliances, kitchen accessories, cooking and the rest. Those words are keywords related to what that's multi-purpose chopper. So that those keywords, you can use them as interest. So those are the interests you can use in targeting that particular product on Facebook. I don't know if you're getting me. You can also target interest. You can also target Facebook pages. That um, Facebook page that has to do with cooking and the rest of it. I don't know if you're getting me, Emmanuel. I'm going to explain more on Facebook ad in subsequent slide. We've not gotten to that section. I will explain what I'm sharing you here now in more details when I get to that section, okay? So now on this um, step, which we have here is step three. On that step three, we do research. We research for suppliers. So now we find reliable wholesale suppliers. We find reliable wholesale suppliers. So now finding reliable wholesale suppliers is very essential in dropshipping business. It's very, very important to find the right supplier when running your own e-commerce dropshipping business. So now here are some places where you can find wholesale suppliers. You can find them on Facebook Marketplace. You can find them on Jumia. You can find them on major marketplace around your location, in major big markets around your location. You can find them on Gigi. And if you have enough money, you can import them from China, from 1688. You can import them from AliExpress. You can basically I import them from most of my product also from 1688 because you can get massive and massive discount on products. Okay, you can get good products, quality products at a very good rate from 1688. Okay, so for those, these are 1688 for are for those that have enough capital to start importing. But if you don't have enough capital to start importing, you can get that's within the country here. So basically, the e-commerce just shipping business model is for you to source this particular product within the country here. You don't have to source them outside the country. But if you have enough money, you can import them, okay? So next year we have is this step four. Step four. First year we've gotten our niche. The second step, we, um, we source for hot selling products. The third step, 
we source for suppliers. Now the first step, we we set up our selling system. We set up our selling system. So now, so for those of you that don't know what selling system is all about, or you're just saying about selling system for the first time, just know that selling system is a platform that enables your business that enables your businesses to sell their products and services online. It includes a range of tools and features that allow your business to create and manage an online or manage an online store. Okay, it enables you to create and manage an online store. So that basically a selling system is what you need. It is very essential for your e-commerce dropshipping business. I repeat, a selling system is very essential for you to setting up the right e-commerce business for you, for your, for, your, for, your, for your brand. So pay close attention to what I'll be sharing you here in your selling system. So I would like to share with you some of these components that make up a selling system. Here are some of the components that make up a selling system. Number one, a selling system comprises of your domain and your hosting, which means that you need a website for you to be able to run an automated selling system. You need a website. When I say automated selling system, I mean a system that will be able to sell for you even when you are offline, even when you are not online. This system will be selling for you. For you to be able to set up such a system, you need to set up or get your domain and your hosting. That is your website. You need to set up your landing page. So now, your selling system consists of your landing page, consists of your order form, where you pick where your customer will fill in the order. It also consists of your autoresponder application. There is an application you have to install on your selling system that help you, one, to reply customers, even when you are sleeping, it help you to, to reply them. You will set up your responding system in such a way that each question your customers will, will, will have in mind to ask you. That system will reply them and give them more details about the product. Your selling system also consists of your Elementor and Install Builder, which is being used in building up the selling system. So without your Elementor and your Install, install, uh, install Builder, you cannot set up your selling system. Your selling system also consists of your social proof. Okay, social proof will increase or skyrocket your sales in your e-commerce dropshipping store. So what I mean, when I'm talking about social proof, it has to do with the proof of people that have bought from you before, testimonial videos, and the rest of you. It improves your sales on your dropshipping platform, on your selling system. If you have enough money, you can create two selling systems. You run a marketing campaign on these two systems, and you see the one that pays that gives you more conversion. So, from my own discovery, from what I've been doing so far, it has shown that selling system that has more social proof tends to convert more. It converts more. So now, a clear. The next one we have is a clear and compiling copy for your hard product. You should have a clear and compiling uh, content for your product. If you don't know how to write. The internet has made it a lot of things easier for us now. This is 2023, guys. I can run an advert within 30 minutes without having a copy, without having a product, without having a content to design that system. I can do that with the help of AI tools. You can use your chat GPT to generate all those things. Within one hour, you have created a selling, with your, your, your selling system content. You set up your ad and you set it running. With your selling system, you can do a lot. Selling system will help you. Your sorry, your your AI tools will help you reduce the time you use in to using creating creating content for your your product and the rest of it. So now, basically, these are the components of a selling system. So now, next year are the advantage of using a selling system. Okay, before the advantage, I would like to share with you a slide. This is my email box. If you are using a selling system, 
eh? you don't have to be there to be seeing you. What I normally do at the end of the day, I will just come to my selling my email boss, and I will check the number of order that I've received. Look at this one now. This particular one here, I received an order from a job for Simon. I received another order from Vincent. I received another order from Ibuku. I received another order from Toby. I got another for Emmanuel John and another one from Divine Chisom. So I'm be, I've been able to get this email because I set my I set my selling system the right way. I automated my selling system. This is one of the advantages of automating your selling system. So all I need to do here is to come to my to my email box, then I'll reach out to the customer and fulfill the order. Then I start making my profit from each transaction that is being completed. That is it. So let's go next we have here is here are the advantage advantages of a selling a hot selling system here are the advantage of a hot selling system so with a hot selling system thousands of people will have access to the product at the same time thousands of people will have access to the product you're selling at the same time so now, if you're using a selling system, it gives you quality leads. When I mean quality leads, I mean quality customers, people that are ready to buy from you. And it also increases your daily sale. This particular system also works on autopilot. When I mean autopilot, if you automate your selling system, you don't have to be physically present. You don't have to be online for you to be able to start making sales and start um, replying or attending to your customers by the help of an automated selling system you are good to go you start seeing massive sales by the help of an automated system you see massive sales that you can't imagine okay now let me just give you an example of a system i set up of um this multi-purpose chopper i just shared with you i set up an automated selling system that email i just shared with you is one of my hot selling products i'm running out on it currently the automated selling system, I picked that particular product. I bought it within the range of 3,000 to 4,000. I got, I picked um, more than one supplier. So remember, I forget to say this. Whenever you're, you got, you get a particular hot selling product, and when you are searching for a, a, a supplier, make sure you get more than one supplier. Because a time will come in your e-commerce business, the order will start to come in. And you don't want to start disappointing your customers. If supplier A fails, you go to supplier B. That is e-commerce business for you. So your player A fails, you go to supplier B. So that is it. Make sure you get supplier that has this particular product enough quantity in a more quantity. That is what I normally do. So I pick that particular product that has a range of cost price of three thousand to four thousand. What did I do? I set up an automated selling system immediately. I created my copy and everything by the help of my chat GPT AI. I set up my landing page. I set everything immediately. I run engagement ad and I start running. I start with engagement ad and I start running conversion ad immediately. I will share with you how to run an ad in this section. Just stay with me, guys. Stay with me. I will share with you how to run ad on your products. So the next slide we have here is advertising, which is step five. I was about talking about this, okay? So let's just continue here. Advertise your product. So if you have an amazing product or service, if you have an amazing product or service, nobody know about it. If nobody know about that product, how would you make sales? How would you make the money? So one of the best and fastest and most reliable way of getting customers and making more sales and growing your business is to run adverts. You have to run adverts for you to make more sales and for you to be able to grow your business. You must advertise your products. You must advertise your products. As I'm talking to you, my ads are currently running on Facebook, running on Instagram, on all the Facebook platform, my ad is currently running. I have two hot selling products I'm selling currently. The ads are currently running. 
So now, for example, let me share with you one of the products. Let me share with you an advert. Look at it. If you look at this particular product, it's a, it's a sponsor. and what 15 million view on facebook this product has 15 million views on facebook so the next one here is an advert whenever i see sponsored under a post it's an advert this particular one here has seven likes um how many comments i can't see it clearly few comments and 182 view Within these two adverts, which of them will you engage on when you see online? When you come online, which of these particular adverts will you engage on? Are you going to engage on advert A that has 50 million views, or you engage with advert B that has 158 views? Which of these adverts will you engage on? Advert A or advert B? Let me see your comment below. Advert A or Advert B? Are you going to engage on Advert A or you're going to engage on Advert B? Let me see your comment below. Just take, for example, you go to the market and you see a lot of people gathering at a particular position. What will you do when you see that? You go over to know what is happening there. That is the same strategy I apply when running my ad campaign for my hot selling product. You see, you can have a hot selling product and you will not still see sale from that product. The reason, be, the reason for that is because you are not running your ad campaign the right way. If you are running your ad campaign the right way, my brother, my sister, you will see massive results from your campaign. Here is what I normally do. This is a, this, this is a top secret for those who are currently running ad or those who are into e-commerce already. This is a top secret for you all. This is what I normally do. Number one, I will, after picking my hot selling product and designing my landing page and everything, all the automation and everything, what I normally do is this. I will run an engagement ad. I will run an engagement ad. In this my engagement ad, I will target cheap countries, cheap Asian countries, Asian countries that whenever I'm running my ads to those countries, I will get cheap cost of engagement. The main purpose of you, you, whenever you're running an ad, make sure you're spending less in your ad campaign. I will set up an engagement ad. In this engagement ad, I'm going to target countries like um, India. I'll target the major cities in India. I will target um, Bangladesh. I will target Pakistan. I will target Thailand. These countries, if you target these countries, you'll be getting zero point something naira per engagement. Guys, you'll be getting cost of like say 0 0.9, 0 0.2, 0 0.5 naira per engagement, guys. It is very, very cheap. You'll be getting cheaper engagement. With what I normally do, I will not split test my advert. I will split test the engagement advert. I will target men, I will target women, I will target both men and women. Then I will run it 500 naira per advert. I will run this advert for two days. It is going to gather enough engagement. I'll be getting thousands of likes and hundreds of comments and thousands of views. After achieving that result for two days, I will now retarget. This time around, I will not be targeting those countries. I'll be targeting Nigeria because that is where I want to sell my product to. I will target Nigeria. That is what you should do. I will not target Nigeria. When I target Nigeria, I've gotten my engagement. So whenever people see my engagement online and I'm selling a hot product, people rush to me. They will rush to my, to my, to my, to my, to my product and they will start placing order. When they come to my product, they will click on it and they will start interacting with my campaign. So if you use this strategy I just share with you here, this strategy I share with you are just part of the strategy I use. I'm applying in my campaign. Whenever I'm running adverts on my products, my e-commerce products.
So I see Yomi. Yomi say thank you. I got it, sir. And um, Yomi Emmanuel. Emmanuel says, "Hey, yes, advance A will give you that result you are looking for." So guys, let's not waste time here. Let me proceed immediately, so I can round off with this training. So guys, if you are just joining us, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. Subscribe to my channel, guys. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Please, guys, subscribe to this channel. Like this video. Share this video to anyone you know that's in e-commerce. Anyone you know that's into e-commerce, share this video to them, guys. Share the video to them. So now the next step here, which is step six, have a great customer service. After all these things, make sure you have a good customer service. Learn how to create an amazing experience for your customer. Learn how to speak politely and show them some respect. Don't talk to customers anyhow. Don't quarry your customers and talk to them and use all sorts of words to them. So if you get step one of these steps I've been sharing with you to so step five and you failed with step six, your business will go down. You will not make sales from your dropshipping business. That is the truth here. If you don't have good customer service, you are not going to sell sales. Sorry. You are not going to make sales from your dropshipping business. Please have a good customer service. You see, the reason why a lot of people don't make sales here, not because they are not getting the right product, not because they're not getting quality lead, it's because they don't know how to talk to people. Thousands of people will come to you. Hundreds of people will place order. But you don't know how to follow them up and close the deal. You don't know how to follow them up and close the deal. That is the reason why a lot of people are messing this up. So let me tell you, if you don't know how to talk to people, you look for your wife, you look for your girlfriend, or your girlfriend will look, help you do the customer service part of the business. Your sister will do the, call your, the, the, the customer service part of the business. They cannot be eating your money without working for you. We all know in this age and time, for you to be able to make money, or for you to be able to get money to send to your siblings, you have to work. So you tell them to work. They'll work for you, they'll do customer service for you. Okay? So now you have a great customer service that will make your customer come back and buy more from you again and again. See, if you have a good customer service, you will be able to upsell your customer. You'll be able to sell other products to your customers without stress. You'll be able to sell them to them without stress. We are already we are already exceeding one hour, but I just have to continue. No problem. We're going to continue. So now the final step, which is the final phase, is your delivery. We all know in Nigeria, payment on delivery work the most. You can either deliver the product yourself, or you use a self-delivering agent. This is what I normally do. I use a self-delivering agent because I sell products in Lagos. I sell products in Abuja. I'm in Abuja. But most times, I do Abuja delivery myself. But the customer don't know I'm the one selling the product. They'll think I'm a delivering guy. I do the delivery in Abuja myself. Sometimes, if I'm free, I do the delivery in Abuja myself. In Lagos, I have a delivering agent. In Port Harcourt, I have a delivering agent. I do this delivery for me. See, I, I target some, 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 some states in Nigeria. I don't target everywhere in Nigeria. Majorly, or uh, basically, or majorly, most times I don't target the north because most of the logistics in the north is not straight, you know? I basically target Lagos, Abuja, Port Harcourt. I target, yeah, I target some parts of Nasarawa, which is between Abuja, you know, Abuja shares boundary with Nasarawa. Okay, I target some part in Nasarawa, which is within the Nanya axis, Maraba axis, and the rest of them. And also, I target some part of um, the Western states, okay? Aside Lagos, I target some Western states and some states in the East. Okay, I target those states where I have my delivery guys that also do my delivery, okay? So now, the reason why payment on delivery works the most in Nigeria, we all know Nigerians. You are skeptical. You are always scared to buy things online. Even if it is Angel Michael that is selling something online, people will not still believe that Angel Michael can still sell. Angel Michael is for you. So this is Nigeria. So the best method to sell your products online is to do payment on 
delivery. So now here, here are the seven steps. Here are the seven steps. Here are the seven steps on starting up your e-commerce drop shipping business. Here are the seven steps of setting up your e-commerce drop shipping business. So guys, if you know you are getting value or you have been getting value from what I'm sharing you with you here today, come to the comment section and type, I am getting value. If you know you are getting value from this information I'm sharing with you here, come to the comment section and type, I am getting value. I want to see like two, three comments before I proceed. Type on the comment section, I am getting value. Even me, myself, I am getting value. So let me type it. I am, I am getting value. Type, I am getting value. If you know you've gotten value from what I've shared with you today. Type, I am getting value in the comment section. If you know you've gotten value from the information I have shared with you today. Type on the comment section, I am getting value. I'm waiting for your message. I am waiting for your message. Type, I am getting value. Yes, Imani says I'm getting value. I'm waiting for like two more persons to type, I am getting value. Type on the comment section, I am getting value with the information. So if you are not jotting this information I'm sharing with you here, if you are not writing them down, guys, you are losing out because this video is not going to last here for a long time. Type, I am getting value. Siroc Nigeria says, I am getting value. Yes, guys. I need one more comment. I am getting value. Then we proceed. I need one more comment. Then we proceed. Okay. Felicia said, I am getting value. Yes, I am really happy that a lot of us here are really getting value from this information I'm sharing with you here today. I'm excited that you're getting value from what I'm sharing with you here today. So guys, uh, um, as easy as this process, or as easy as everything I've said here might sound, you need a community and mentorship program. You need a community and mentorship program. See, this whole process might sound easy. It can sound easy, yes. It sound is not. It can. It uh, sound easy from the beginning from, of this training to this point. It sounds easy. So, but the truth is, you need a community for you to be able to grow. You need a mentorship program. You need a community and a mentorship program, guys. Very, very important. You need a community and a mentorship program. So guys, um, you need a program that will hold you by the hand and put you through this process the right way. See, I know anyone here can just start this job shipping as immediately after this training. You can start it, but it can take you months. It can take you weeks with a lot of mistake and wasting of money before you start seeing results. It's going to take you time, months, weeks before you start seeing Results, it will take you months, two months, and three months after wasting your money before you start seeing results. But I don't want you to go through the same process. I want to hold you by the hand and put you through this procedure the right way. So I have an offer for you here that is going to give you the best and awesome result in starting up with your e commerce business, your e commerce dropshipping business. Okay, so here are the um here are the the outline. I don't know if you can see it. Here are the outline for my e-commerce dropshipping class, e-commerce dropshipping webinar. Here are the outline. The number one outline I have here is an introduction. Okay, introduction, an overview to of e-commerce dropshipping. I'll be giving you an introduction of what e-commerce Dropshipping is all about. I'll be giving you more details information on a selling system. I'll give you more details information on an automated and manual selling system. I will show you how to automate your selling system and how to 
You can either do it manually or you can do it, you can do it automated. I'll be sharing with you more details on product research. I'll be going in depth on product research. I will go to the point of sharing you more products. Every month I'll be sharing with you hot selling products. Not just hot selling products. I'll be giving you the same product I'm sharing, the same product I'm running advert on, the same product I'm putting my money into. This is not what what I'm sharing with you is not what I learned or I'm just teaching it. I'm sharing with you, I'll be sharing with you what I am practicing. I'll be sharing with you what I practice. So that is the, the, the product research is going to be in depth. I'll be sharing with you hot selling products. I will share with you factors you should look out for before selling or before settling for any kind of product. I will share with you products you should not be selling in e-commerce dropshipping. I will also show you how to source for suppliers and how to negotiate to get a better deal. I will share all that with you. I will talk more on the hot selling system, on the selling system matter, how to run a highly converting advert on Facebook and Instagram, how to build an automated selling system. I will also share with you the domain on how to set up your domain and hosting. How to build a highly converting campaign. I will share that with you right in this um, the Dropshipping Academy. I will share that. How to set up your sales funnel, how to create everything. I will share that with you. And um, also, you will learn how to, uh, I will show you how to launch your e-commerce business, your e-commerce shipping business in three steps. I also talk more on how to close your deals to your confirmation calls and how to communicate with your customers to close your deals and how to handle objections when it comes. I'll show you how to handle objections and sales and the rest of it. I'll also show you how to calculate your profit because when the money starts coming, if you don't know how to calculate your profit, you run out of loss. I'll show you how to do that in um, the Dropshipping Academy. So now this Dropshipping Academy Academy comes with a bonus. You will learn how I'll be giving out a blueprint on how to hit, hit six figures within a month. Within four weeks, you learn how to hit six figures in your e-commerce dropshipping business. I'm the one telling you that. Stanley is telling you that you're going to hit six figures in this business if you join this dropshipping academy. And also, I'll be giving out e-commerce. I'll be giving a bonus on mini importation from China and procurement. This bonus is going to be massive. You'll be learning how to procure from China, how to import from 1688, how to become a procurement agent, how to charge people, how to import for people and make money for yourself with zero capital. That is this e-commerce mini importation from China and procurement bonus I'm giving to you. You're going to learn how to procure from China by yourself without an agent. It's a bonus I'm giving to you. And also, you will be having access to my support group you are not going to be having only having access to this training. You also have access to my support group. So now this training is going to be on e-learning platform. It's going to be on my e-learning platform. So when you sign up for this dropshipping academy course, or this dropshipping um, business course, you are going to have access to the e-learning platform. You're also going to have access to my support group where you interact with other dropshippers. Okay? So guys, this training comes with a fee. It comes with a fee, it's not free. It comes with a fee. So now, let me show you, here's a picture of my, um, one of my Chinese e-commerce sites. This is a dashboard, my dashboard, my dashboard. If you see it closely, I have made 2,000 orders on the 16th, that is the Chinese e-commerce platform. That is where, I, under the, this is under the importation from China section, right, which is among the bonus I'm giving to you. I'm just sharing this with you here so you know that I'm not just teaching. I'm sharing with you here what I am practicing. Those of you who are out there who knows what I do, who know the business I do, you know that importation is one of the business I do. I have done more than 5,000 imports from China alone for myself and for my customers. 5,000. Here is one of, here is one of my, um, one of my dashboard. So guys, Here's the certificate you also be getting after attending um, the webinar. Here's the certificate for one of my students. You get a certificate of completion. When you attend the course, you get the certificate of 
participation. Here is the certificate from one of my students. You will get that after attending and completing all the courses on the e-learning platform. So now this e-commerce um, academy, dropshipping academy comes with a fee. So now to register for this training section, you have to make a one-time payment of 10,000 naira only to have access to my e-commerce learn e-commerce um on the e-learning platform to have access to all the training section to have access to the um support group everything there you can have access to it for ten thousand naira only one time payment no more no pay two thousand naira later ten thousand naira you have access to all the complete training on this e-commerce dropshipping academy course and also, this course comes with a 100% money refund policy. This comes with a 100% refund policy. It comes with a 100% refund policy. You see, this e-commerce course, after going through this course, and you did not learn everything I've shared with you, I'm going to refund you. If after going through this e-commerce course, and you did not learn everything I've shared with you, I'm going to refund you all your money. If you do not get everything that I shared with you on the course content, I, Stanley, will refund you all your money and I'm also going to apologize to you for wasting your time. This is to show you how confident am I about what I'm sharing with you. This is to show you the confidence I have in what I'm sharing. This is the confidence, this is what I'm showing you because I have the confidence with what I'm going to share with you and with the results you're going to get from this e-commerce. So guys, this, Early bird offer of 10,000 never is only available for those 10 persons. We don't want crowd. It's just 10 persons. The 10,000 never offer is available for only just 10 persons. So now, if you're interested to join this academy, if you're interested to have access to this e-learning platform, to have access to the dropshipping um, support group, just send me a message on WhatsApp now Tell me you want to join the e-learning platform. Tell me you want to join, you want to have access to the, the, the e-learning platform. You want to have access to this for the early bird offer of 10,000 euros. Send me a message now straight on WhatsApp that you want to have access to the training. You want to join the early bird offer. You want to get the discount of the early bird offer now. If you are interested in the training, Go straight to my WhatsApp message and tell me you want to get the early bed offer of 10,000 euro. Please, guys, this offer is only available for 10 persons. Please, it's only available for 10 persons. So, guys, see you in the next, or see you guys in the webinar. See you in the academy section. See you in the training proper. And, guys, don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Share this video to your friends and family out there who will need this video. Share this video out there. If you want to join the early bed offer, send me a message on WhatsApp, and I will see you all in the academy. I love you guys, and also thank you all for your time. Thank you all for your time, and um, bye for now. I'm waiting for your message. Bye.